good, beautiful morning, y'all. Second day going after turkeys, trying to get my first one. And I'm meeting up with the mullet man right now. I haven't seen him in a while. See what old boy's up to. Mullet man. You sleepy? Dude, I'm, I'm, I'm dying. <laughs> I'm dying. I need that kolache and coffee so bad. Well, it's here. Let's go kill I, Let's go do one. That's the best way to wake up. Best way to wake yourself up is to go get a turkey, especially if you've never got one, y'all. But I'm dragging right now. I know, tough life being an outdoor YouTuber, right? I got some new boots, y'all. About to strap these puppies on. We're about to get that call out and hopefully go get this thing done. My neck right now is so swollen from whatever was biting us the other day. Oh man, you got them little fast, fast strap booties. Well, man, how you been? I'm good, man. I'm ready to kill another turkey. Did you? Yeah. So I went turkey hunting yesterday. As you know, I've never killed one. Now in my older age, I'm like, I want to enjoy all the outdoor babies. Were there a lot of turkeys on Fork? Uh, I never saw one, no. I never heard any gobblers. Really? No. Right. Never. We got a lake around here. And, uh, lake, oh, yeah. <laughs> little secret in, mullet in, man's spot. In the springtime. <laughs> and it's just you like, gobble, gobble. There's some deer out there. Oh, yeah. There's some deer. White tail. Oh, those are, oh, those uh, are axis. Axesis. Oh, that autofocus never, never quite nailed that one. Try not to do lens here, y'all. Um, is there a kolache in here? There it is. Yeah, there's another deer. Golly, things are moving. Those are shallow. Well, the man's saving my life right now with a coffee and a kolache. We're running literally with this white tail. Come on, autofocus. Get in there on that guy. How fast he's running. About to jump in. Oh, oh, oh! What an amazing animal. American white tailed deer. Wish I could run like one. Because nothing runs like a deer. <laughs> Man, that's a good slogan. Somebody should use that. Nothing runs like a deer. You know what I mean? Mike was in the woods. 
this is a beautiful spot. If we ever get one to come in, it's gonna be awesome. Oh, we've re oh my gosh! Airplane, we had such calmness. Then the airplane goes right over. I can't believe it. I'll wait. I'll wait for you, Southwest. That's right. Serve your peanuts. We're going after some fish, y'all. Some fish to put in the cooler. Um, Mullet Senior. Mullet Senior is actually out on the water, and he's he's dialed into some fish right now. So we're gonna go meet up with him and try to put some fish in the box, and maybe even do some fish for the bay. Oh, we're just fishing. Just having fun fishing. Outdoorsmen, women that are finding, uh, hunting, fishing. Um, they got a, they have a voice there that they have not had anywhere in else. A very right now, y'all, we're getting a sneak peek. It's not a sneak peek. It's out there. <laughs> it's out there. It's Bullet Man did a radio show with the Outdoor Zone in Central Texas. I didn't even know that I was on here. And uh, catch, clean, out. and cook is kind of his style, hunting uh, different things. Uh, catching different things, cleaning them, and then trying them, eating them. I can't stand all this. That's dude. your thing. Morning, guys. How's it going? Eat good. good man. Eat good. Good. Man. I don't know. A couple of months ago, maybe, I was watching. Uh, I've kind of grown to be a fan of uh, a handful of different YouTube channels, and one of them I was watching, I guess, Lake Fork Guy. I'm a big fisherman, oh, yeah. and hmm. I was watching him, and he was going hunting, and there was this guy, Mike, that they were riding around with, and uh, and then next thing I know is Mike turns into Mullet Man and Mullet Man turns into a YouTube channel and the YouTube channel is now a, a brand, baby. So, Boom. congratulations. Mullet Man, eat good. Yeah. That's, that's enough of that. That's, that's I, pretty I, cool though. I, I is that not cool though? Dude, I'm proud of you, man. Thanks, man. It's, it's all been, because of you. Been doing it's good. all because of my LFG. Uh, no. Mike's Mullet. been working hard. Mike's been working hard. If you want to check out his content, what he's doing. Um, he's even got a new addition to the mullet cave he's working on right now. And some daggum, he makes his own turkey jerky. You got a how-to on that on your channel, don't you? I did. I already did. I, I mean, he's just, he's doing everything, especially eating, eating good. So, uh, eating too good, getting fat. Mike's been, Mike's been really fun to, uh, have on this channel. I know you guys like him, but any of you new subscribers want to go check out his channel. He's almost at 50K. Like 50k away. subs, y'all go down there, subscribe to his channel, get him there right now. Because you're giving away, you're doing a giveaway on your channel, air right? Gun, yeah. He's giving away an air gun. You guys saw the air guns that we picked up, and then I got that squirrel with the other day. Um, he's doing a giveaway for 50k and then 100k as well, different packages. So uh, go subscribe, and he's gonna be doing a giveaway over there. So. Now on to fishing things, baby. I get yeah. excited just when I see the water. Lake's, lake looks calm and ready, ready to bite. I can smell some two-cycle oil burning over here. Folks starting to get out on the lake. Oh, shoot. Mullet's waving me over there. What is it, dude? Is it a big bass? Dude, they're blowing up in there. They're blowing up? What's blowing up? Big bass. Are you serious? Yeah. Okay. Got something I can throw? Yeah, dude, here. We're going to do a little bank fishing until uh, Mullet Senior gets here. He's going to take us out on the water and do some striper fishing. But right now, they're, they're blowing up over here on the water. They're blowing up. Oh, oh, there's a boil. Better get out there, son. As I don't think it's the same one. I think there's multiples in there. I just broke off a fish. Not the same one. Coffee jig. <laughs> well, 
Dang it, dude. What are we doing? I don't know. We have no bass gear. You want to go get the bass boat? Mm-hmm. Oh, he took my worm, you son of a gun. Well, man broke off one of my baits, so we're literally... You guys ever do this? Go treasure troving in your, uh, in your truck? Look at that, dude. Found a lure. We don't have any other lures here because we're waiting on, on Mullet Senior to get here. We're going to go out with him, but... We're literally just looking. I know this is silly because I literally, um, I have, you new guys know how many baits I have, but we're on the road here. We're on road, road time. That's why I always keep extra lures in my truck, you know? I stick them in the carpet, I leave them in the doorways. Aww. Look at that. You know, things like that. Now, you just need a hook though, bud. Light flukes. Yeah, no, we you, can find a hook. You need a hook. Well, That's the problem. You got shotgun shells, you got, we can't you got turkey vests, you got air guns, you got ARs, you got. Uh, you know, mullet combs. Naga. You got that. At least you caught one. I broke one off and then had a couple dabble on my bait, but I really was not equipped, you know. I ended up throwing a crappie jig with a little nugget on it, which, you know, not my best bass selections, but I told Mullet Man, he's got to keep an emergency dangle box in his truck at all I times, like I got. Water's still about 62 out here. It's a little chilly. Mullet Senior, backing it down. Going out in the big boat. What a great outdoor day, y'all. It's like 73 degrees, perfect temps. Okay. Didn't want to take that leap a little too far. Ready. Yeah, strapper time, yeah! This water's clear. All right, well, it looks like we got some downriggers, so I'm guessing we're gonna be doing some rigging downward. 25, market's on down 30. Wait for the next bite. Oh, strapper. Come on, be a big old pork chop. Take a drag? Yeah, you can drag. At the beginning? Yeah. Probably a big old white. No. Justin Probably a turtle. Justin Ain't good. A white king. <laughs> Is that an eater? eater? Oh, yeah. That's what, I, that's what I'm talking about. Ain't good. Heck First yeah. Five minutes. First five minutes trolling. Got the skunk okay. off her back. Wabam. Oh, I love him. Not as big as I thought he was going to be. Yes, Mike. Yes. Ugh. Danner. Those are some solid white bass uh, that we got in the boat. These are, these guys were, were chasing after the lures as well. And uh, you know me. <laughs> They just love me. They want to come home with me. I'm having to put my daggum flannel on. It's been so chilly. This weather's just been crazy today, y'all. Mike, what you got going on here? Oh, a little blackened fish. Some uh, make your pee smell bad, those things. Yeah, that will do it right the there. Pringles, I don't know why I got these out. You yeah. got that special critter glitter on me. Critter glitter. You get it at uh, bulletman.net. Bulletman.net, you went with net. Uh, we couldn't buy dot com. It was already taken. <laughs> was it really? Yeah. There's another mullet man. Yeah, he wanted, the comms? He, he wanted a lot of money for it too. Oh man, that diggity dog. Uh, I haven't had blackened fish in a while, actually. Um, typically, I've I've done blackened fish on like saltwater fish. I know this is a crazy vlog, y'all. It literally started with turkey hunting. I'm still still got that on the list. Still up there. Trust me. I want to go get a turkey. And uh, my boy Outlaw's coming down pretty soon and we're going to be going after turkeys again probably with mullet man and maybe a few other cats i was so jazzed up this morning been close the last few days anyway got to see some bass on the beds got to catch a few fish it's not a bad day in the outdoors the critter glitter 
It's in the air. It's like being maced. <coughs> hey now. It's strong, I warn y'all. If you've never blackened anything in the kitchen, it, it doesn't matter what spice you're using, anything cayenne. You get right in there with that, that pan and get going. And get up in your lungs. Hopefully it'll <coughs> hopefully it will uh cure my neck of the gnat bites that just lays its eggs in you or something. I don't know. Look at that big old gator mullet man shot earlier this year. Oh dear, the deer. Oh, that critter glitters, it's wafting up there. He's probably gonna start sneezing here pretty soon. Thank you, mullet man. Dude, that looks phenomenal. That was swimming like a couple hours ago. Just take a little of that mullet mace off of there. Oh yeah, that's good. Good, good. Hey, good call on that butter. Good call on that butter. All right, let's try this. I'll just let that speak for itself. It was pretty good, eh? Wasn't expecting that. Hmm. I was expecting you to say, eat good. Eat good. I'm going to leave Mullet Man and Mrs. Mullet here. <clears throat> I hope you all do okay with this cayenne, this cayenne spoke. Stop acting like it. It's bad. <clears throat> it's good. It's good go, for your go soul. Go get some cream for your neck. I'm going to go get some cream for my neck. You're letting neck. bugs in. Look at all these bugs. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Mullet Man. I'll see you on the next turkey hunt, son. See ya, Lake Fork guy. Good hanging out with you. Yep, you too, man. Take care of that mullet. Eat good. Woo, that's all I got for y'all today. Crazy day in the outdoors, y'all. Subscribe right here so you don't miss the next dangle or hunt. Not sure yet. And if you want to check out my boy Mullet Man, links down below. And I will see you guys on the next one.